Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Shanice and welcome to Simply Nikla. Today I have a Valentine's Day nail tutorial for you guys. So let's go ahead and jump into it. But before you do, how about go down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already for any other nail tutorials. And I'm excited for the video for next week. So you don't want to miss out, so subscribe. But also as well, sometimes throughout the video, give me a like. So subscribe, give me a video like, whatever you want to do. But other than that, let's get started with this video. And lock your way so we can break up out the Okay, to begin this nail tutorial, I wanted to do something a little bit different. I have a little different medium within my nail tutorial. So I found this tube of glitter. It has hearts and stars and all lovely things inside here. So I thought it would be great for this nail tutorial. So the index finger, pinky, and thumb, I'm going to do the same thing for each finger. These three fingers are almond shaped and clear. I want the glitter to be like halfway and up. So I decided to do something a little different than I'm not used to doing. And and so I have my clear nail. Before I glue them on, I put some of my gelish foundation gel polish halfway of the nail and up. I then went and placed the hearts, only the hearts. I didn't do any of the stars that's in this glitter and put place the hearts where I want it and really pack that in. Then I put it right under the UV light to dry it. Then I applied another coat of the gelish polish on top to make sure it's not like any bumps or grooves. And I did that twice so it's nice and smooth and really look like some glass nails once you put them on. Circus. So once I have the glitter situated, I glue those on and those was looking fire already. And even those nails are already halfway done. So for those three nails, I applied from the cuticle up to halfway where the heart's glitter is at. I applied LA Colors Color Last and this beautiful shimmer pink called Hope. And then I used a makeup sponge wedge and kind of faded out at the edges so you still see some of the hearts peeping through. And I did that twice on each nail. <music> of that pink I went and used Ellie Colors Color Craze Shimmer Pink called Fairy Floss and I'll apply that onto the nail only once. Essentially, those nails were done like I said pretty quick so for the middle finger and the ring finger I decided to do some hearts and each heart is a different color so for those two nails the colors that I used was again the LA colors color last and their pink hope then I used LA colors color last darker pink called never ending and then of course I used a red was from LA colors color craze and that color is called hot blooded so I essentially just started with the hope pink and made a heart shape on both of the nails and went on from there from that heart did another heart shape with it with the darker pink and then with the red all the way through the whole nail like the middle of the heart shape was needed some more oomph so I added the red in the middle of the shape and it really brought everything together really focused everything and that's essentially how I did these nails <laughs> After I finished the whole nail, I went back with a second coat of each color and filled everything in, fixed any lines up that I need to to make sure everything is nice and precise and how I need it to be. So after that, it's pretty much done. This nail tutorial is pretty quick and easy. Um, all I had to do was put my top coat and the top coat that I used was LA Colors Quick Color Top Coat and it's their fast drying top coat and I apply that to every nail. <music> And 
so this is how my nails turned out. I love them and they are so pretty and perfect for Valentine's Day. And I want to show you the clear glass look of the nails. So look at them. I love them. And I really hope you give this a try if you really want it to. But I hope you really like this video. These nails are so cute and perfect. But other than that, thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll catch you back next week. Bye.